Hola amigos, this is Marco Balvanera, and you're listening to my bitchy channel, La Verdad con Marco, and welcome back. Today on the second Saturday of the month, I want to dedicate this video to all the people that made second Saturday happen for many years. So this is a true story, guys. I had this very inexpensive cannon that I bought for a business that I had called my ex Novia back in 2013. It was just sitting around the house. I no longer had the business, and I no longer had the Novia. So as I was coming out of my depression, I took to the streets, and I started shooting photos and videos, mainly at art venues throughout San Anto. It wasn't a great camera, but I couldn't pass up capturing a time that was powered by something bigger than myself. So I set out with my Canon T3 Rebel. And I just shot all the time. I shot when I was drunk. I shot when I was high. I shot video and photos even when I didn't want to shoot anything. By the way, I just wanted to point out that I no longer drink. Um, but you know, taking my camera and moving around and shooting all these amazing characters really filled me up with joy and hope. So these videos that I shot were on a second Saturday in November. And as you can see, the weather was perfect by the way people are dressed. This is November 2016, second Saturday. This is just a few shots. I have months and months of video in my library. So to be honest with you, I picked random videos on this particular day because sometimes I tend to overthink shit and I never get stuff done. So this is a whole new approach for me. I really loved the uh, shooting video on second Saturday because there never really was a bad time to shoot. Every shot that you would take was amazing. Every video. And what I mean by amazing, I mean that you can capture a lot of essence and character and substance. Um, The footage that you see here was taken from around 9.30 p.m. Probably until about 1.30 a.m. where things get really crunk. But before I go on, I just have to express my thanks to all the people that made Second Saturday happen. Um, Andy uh, and his whole crew. Everyone was always uh, really kind and accepting in my opinion, this is a huge part of what made San Antonio San Anto. Just to watch people from different races and places come together to express themselves with many types of materials and forms of expression. It was like being in a different dimension, man. It was just getting away from the daily grind of San Antonio. The um, culture and the art in this community was really like no other form. I had uh, visited many other art venues all the way from Dallas to Corpus and Austin and many other cities. And I have to say that pound for pound, um, there was nothing else like it. Yes, they might have had better galleries but not a banging soul to go with with it yes they may have had better galleries but not a banging soul to go with it like the way San Anto did or still does of course we're just kind of locked down right now <laughs> the people who participated and created this event are like heroes to me man I always felt in awe at every event the conversations always had meaning and it was okay not to know something because everyone was always happy to share their hopes, 
knowledge and dreams. I think one of my favorite parts of the whole event was letting loose on the dance floor afterwards and celebrating the soul. On these second Saturdays, I felt like the mind and the soul were re-energized. And it really felt like it could never end. I like to consider it an oasis for the soul. I live for this moment every second Saturday of the month. Thank you, Andy and all the artists and the people that made this happen for the community. I'll be posting up different videos with commentaries. If you like the videos, please feel free to donate and I promise to stay at home and create more videos. Again, this is La Verdad con Marco. Thank you for letting me share and keep it real.